Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing a back to school makeup tutorial for you guys. So yeah, school's about to start. So I was thinking, you know, some of you who want to wear makeup to school and don't know like how much is the right amount of makeup or if it's too much or too little. It's really simple, really natural. It's almost like a no makeup makeup look. Very simple everyday makeup look. I think I only use like six products. So I only use, thank you, my foundation, concealer, translucent powder, brow, pencil, mascara, blush, bronzer, and lip balm, lipsticks. It's like around eight, like it's really minimal and really simple, really easy. So I hope you guys actually enjoyed watching this and actually make use of this makeup tutorial for back to school look. So if you guys want to see how I did this makeup look for going back to school, then please keep watching. Okay, so the very first thing that we are going to do is to moisturize our face. So I've already done that. So right now I'm just going to apply my foundation. And I'm using the Revlon Colorstay Foundation in Toast. So I'm just going to apply that with my Damp Beauty Blender. And this one is a medium to full coverage uh, foundation. But if you want to opt for a lighter coverage, you can always mix your foundation with a moisturizer to give you the BB cream effect. So it wouldn't be too much things on your face. So once we have applied our foundation, I'm moving straight on to concealing the rest of our face. So I'm just going to conceal under my eyes because I have pretty bad dark eye circles. And also recently I've broken out a lot. So I'm just going to apply the concealer where I've previously broken out or like it's looking red or any blemishes that I have. So that will be it for the base of our face. So right now I'm just going to set all of that in with my Catrice Translucent Powder to avoid like kicking up my face. Okay, so the next step would be to fill in our brows and I'm going to fill that in with the Catrice Brow Pencil in Date with Ashton. And my brows just take forever to do, so I'm just going to fast forward this part a lot so you guys won't have to sit through watching the whole brow process. And once I'm done filling my brows, I'm just going to use this angled brush and dip it into the Bahama Mama by the Balm just to fill in like the front and the end part of my brows because that tends to get, be lighter than the other parts of my brows. And once I'm done with that, I'm just going to seal that in with my eyelash and eyebrow gel by Catrice. So for school, obviously, we're not going to highlight and contour and get all into that. But I'm just going to slightly like bronze up and contour and chisel that cheekbone just a tiny bit. So I'm just using a very little product and I'm just going to brush that on my forehead as well and also around my jaw. So now the perfect school makeup look would not be complete if we do not apply our blush. So I'm just applying the... Catrice blush in the shade of Coco's Apricot, my favorite blush of them all because it has like a tiny bit of shimmer so it gives you that nice glow but it's not too heavy. And now just to give my eyes some definition, I'm just going back in with the Bahama Mama and I'm just applying that onto my crease so my eyes wouldn't look too thin and look more awake. And also my nose, I'm just going to contour that a tiny bit and I'm just going to blend that out with my beauty blender so it wouldn't look too harsh and fake looking. So now to finish off the eyes, I'm just going to apply my favorite mascara, which is the Catrice Glamadol Volume Mascara. And I'm just going to apply two coats of that. I don't want it to be too dramatic because after all, we're just going to go to school. We're not going to go party. And so to complete this entire look, I'm just going to apply any lip balm and then I'm going to use my Wet n Wild Mega Last Lipstick in the shade Mocha Licious and I'm just going to be applying that to give myself that very natural, nudish lip with a pop of color so I wouldn't look too dead and so there you go guys, that's the final look. Hey guys, so that is all for my back to school makeup look. If you want to see more of this like back to school or school related videos like hair tutorials or outfit related things or other makeup looks then just leave it down in the comments below and I'll get working on that. Also if you do like this video give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!